Investigators in New York City are searching for clues after United Healthcare's CEO was shot and killed in what police are calling a targeted attack. Surveillance cameras captured the attack on Brian Thompson as he was on his way to an investor meeting. There are reports the bullet casings left behind had writing on them, including the words deny, defend, and depose. Fox's Meredith Gorman has the latest on the search for the killer. Fox have obtained this surveillance camera footage from the Hilton Hotel in Midtown, showing the masked gunman following and then gunning down 50-year-old Brian Thompson as he is just steps away from the entrance to the hotel. Due to the graphic nature of the incident, we are freezing the video before Thompson falls to the ground. Now, law enforcement says a silencer appears to have been used on the gun as the gunman calmly shot the CEO. It appears the suspect was lying in wait for several minutes. And as the victim was walking to the conference hotel, the suspect approached from behind and fired several rounds, striking the victim at least once in the back and at least once in the right calf. Many people passed the suspect, but he appeared to wait for his intended target. New updated photos of the suspect in a Starbucks shortly before the shooting have been released by Crime Stoppers, as you can see here. He is masked and dressed in all black, wearing a tan or neutral colored backpack. The suspect fired his gun, then fled through the Ziegfeld alleyway across the street, where authorities are investigating a cell phone that they found on the ground before he hopped on an electric bike and headed down 6th Avenue into Central Park. Multiple witnesses say they saw the shooting unfold. I hear the three shots. I was, I was parking down there in the car. I hear three shots. Yeah, and then when I looked, there's a man down. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and then the guy crossed and then he ran. He's, he's a white male, in, all in black, with a backpack. He, he, crossed, he crossed this way. The, the Odyssey. The diver told me he was hanging around the whole night waiting for the guy, the shooter. And he just uh, inside the car waiting for him. Soon he see him, he just shot him. Authorities now urging the public to come forward with any information that they may have as they insist the victim appears to have been deliberately targeted. Meredith Gorman, Fox News.